morning YouTube friends, subscribers, non-subscribers, followers, fans, YouTubers. This is JW Solar USA. It's another day here in Minnesota. Um, according to the weather, it's supposed to be nice weather today, sunny. Well, this is what is happening right here from the um, command center. And um, I have the uh, FlexMax 60. Then I have the uh, Outback. No, sorry, the Midnight Classic. They're running side by side. They're doing the job done. And everything is looking pretty good here. Uh, so my previous videos, as you guys see, this array, I have two set of arrays. This one is facing uh, the morning sun, different directions. And this one is just waking up. It's collecting right now. They're all running on high voltage. Uh, this is a 48 volt system. If you're just concerned, um, see there's a VOC right there. It's supposed to be like 110. Because these are 55.5 open socket and 40.5 continuous. Okay, that's running right here. So you guys can see. And so what's here? These are just about um, 40, 46. I think it's a 46.7, something like that. Well, I'll put the um, uh, correct information there. Well, it's bringing 3.3 amps, 3.4 amps, and uh, 72 volts, and 4.6 amp back to the batteries here. Let me see. That doesn't make any difference. I'll show you VOC. It's bringing 250. And the classic is doing its thing. Nice charge controllers. Both of them are awesome charge controllers. If you're looking at uh, starting up your system, I encourage you to spend money on a um, big charge controller at the start because that's your foundation. Because you end up do what a lot of us a lot of people um has done end up buying charge controllers all the time because you end up having probably a mismatch of your panels or you end up having probably a good deal on certain things that you forgot about the charge controller you're off track so buy the charge controller that can take a high VOC or high voltage and it can handle um, from 12, 24, 36, 48 sometimes it goes about 60 you know um, 70 or 60 so it depends to the battery bank you want to deal with okay right now I'm running a 48 volt system here and I have a, so, um, another I've been doing so a lot of upgrade updates and building systems so this is what is coming in right now from the command center dun, dun, dun. jw solar usa so if you haven't seen my system this is my system this is just a quick video for you guys on a sunday morning happy sunday to you guys and um I hope everything's going well for you guys. Well, this this one used to be the old systems here. I didn't even take them down yet, but I still have the old system sitting here. It's a Kotec 24 volt. It's a reserve backup. And this is the other one is a 48 volt system. That's my baby one. And doing an awesome job. Nice controllers. And uh here I have the um the Outback FX 30 48 
here's a mobile system so it's kind of a little bit untidy here because um i've been doing a lot of work you know doing systems and all that kind of stuff so i haven't have time to do mine but i have to revamp the system trying to put all the other stuff so if you guys uh this is the the outback See that outback power system and this is the outback fx 3048 there's a 48 volt uh, inverter inverter charger this is the mobile version okay and um, you can see it's really built really good heavy heat sink it has a turbo fan in here that kicks in if your batteries are low you plug it into the AC part you can just get power charging your batteries like uh, bad weathers and all that kind of stuff or maybe your battery bank is not topped up and you can plug it in if you want you can just leave it and um, when you're ready you plug it in then you can have all your batteries charged up you don't need a um, extra charger this one can do all the work for you. I put it close so that you guys can see the specs here. And I have a very big wire. Uh, I'm running a 12-3 um, a coming from the AC part. You know, I have a, a, um, a big um, two-odd two cable coming here to the battery. Okay. So, um, just want to give you updates and heads up how the system is doing it's really untidy right now because I'm so busy and um, you guys just to um, give you heads up what's going on here uh, it has been a while I made a video of my system I've been making videos on uh, the system I'm building and the system I'm putting in um, for my clothes um, I call them my allies, close friends. You know, we're all gonna go solar someday, sooner or later. The solar industry, wind, renewable energy, hydro, coal, and all that kind of stuff. It's not going anywhere. This is here to sustain the US power, and that would make that makes um power here in America we have constant power even if we we lost power within a short time we lost power is gonna be just a short time that's what I was gonna say because we always have the source of energy energy uh, compared to other countries that um, they have a lot of blackouts and because of their systems and is um, you know some of them are just political that's what is happening Right here is 8.48 a.m. in the morning. These guys are pushing power right now. And um, if you haven't subscribed yet, I encourage you to subscribe. This is JW Solar USA. And thanks for watching. And God bless. Happy Sunday. Be safe now. Bye-bye. This is the power we're making right now.